Hello, Kristen here. Thank you for tuning into my channel. Um, I am going to do a length check video. Um, the last time I did a length check video was April 6th of this year, and I was going to come back and do one in August, but I said I had just did a trim, and so it didn't make any sense to do one, and I said I would wait until October-ish, November, so here we are middle October. I just measured my hair today, and we this is October 19th. So this video may not be up on the 19th, but it will be up sometime this coming week. <laughs> so um, the last time I measured my hair, um, I measured different sections of my hair. I did the top of my hair um, right here. It was actually like pulled over here or whatever. And I did the crown. I did side one, which is this side. And then I did side two because they're different lengths. And then I did back one, like back one right here, and then back two, which is like the nape of my neck. The reason I did that, um, I did them those different lengths because my hair, when I big chopped my hair, it was chopped in layers because my hair was relaxed in layers, so I just chopped it down. So it's always grown in layers. Yes, my hair is straight. I flat ironed it yesterday. I um, blow dried it and then flat ironed it. So we're going to get started with um, the measurements. Okay, the top of my hair on April 6th which is right here, like right here, or whatever, um, was 10.5 inches, and now it's 12. Um, the crown of my head, right here, was 12, now it's 13. Um, side one of my hair, which is like right here, was 12 inches, now it's 14. Um, side two, which is like right underneath here, was nine inches, now it's 10.2. Um, back one of my hair, like right here, was 11 inches and now it's 13.5. And back two, which is like, you know, the part by the nape of your neck, was 10 inches and now it's 13. So, um, even though I trimmed my hair, I did I couldn't really tell if it had grown, but when I was flat ironing it and I was doing the back of my hair, which I will show you guys, that's where it lands at right here. I could tell that the back had grown faster than any other part of my hair. Um, even, I can tell all over that my hair has grown since I trimmed it last. But the, really the back when I was doing it, I said, okay, the back has grown. So, I mean, different lengths of my hair are growing faster than the other, and that's fine. You know, I'm perfectly fine with that. I'm not out here trying to get you know one length of hair because you know health overall so I did a trim you know back in August which I desperately needed and I thought I might have needed another one but I don't I'm not gonna touch my hair uh, it doesn't seem they don't the ends don't seem damaged or anything and then when I my hair is curly and I twist it there's no little strands of hair in it so I think it just look I think the ends just feel a little dry so you can easily mistake your hair for needing to be trimmed when your ends are dry so it's important to keep them moisturized like coconut oil and seal the coconut oil you know all that stuff so yeah um i am very pleased with the progress if i wouldn't have had a did a trim um if i wouldn't have had a did a trim they ain't even <laughs> if i wouldn't have done a trim it probably be longer but then that would be sacrificing the help of my hair so um i'm glad i needed the trim i'm glad i did it so I mean, all the way from April until now, I think it was April, May, June, July, August, September. That's, what, six months, and I think it's a pretty good length. I might have lost some length somewhere, but I think this is pretty good. Like, the top of my hair went, you know, it was 1.5 inches. I did an inch on one, two inches, and then three inches on the back. So, I think that's a pretty good amount of time within six months to grow hair. Um... But yeah, my hair is growing. Um, I'm very pleased with the growth of my hair. Um, like I, I don't really have a hair goal in mind when it comes to the length of my hair. I really just care about the health of it um, more than anything. Like when it's um, in its curly state, I always take care because it's, it's more in its fragile state when it's curly. Our hair is, is very brittle and so it's very easy to damage. So I really try to take care of it. And, um, yeah, I just, I just flat ironed my hair because I was bored <laughs> and I was in the mood for something different and the weather is finally cooler here so the humidity has not attacked my hair yet. Um, but yeah, I'm loving it. 
Now, I wish I can just straighten my hair a lot more without damaging it, but that's what it is when you have curly hair. So yeah, I'm gonna get out of here, and I am gonna link that link check video down below so you guys can check it out. And until next time, I will see you guys later. Bye.